five steps no six seven steps it'll take you like 20 steps to do this it's super easy okay just watch the whole video Rowan you ready yeah <laughs> Step number one. Step number one. Get all your stuff out that you're gonna yeah. need. Here it is. Impact driver, two drill bits, two clamps, a metal cutting blade, wrench with the socket, drill, grinder, and a miter saw. Step number two. Get out all the supplies that you're gonna need for this thing, okay? Go to the store and buy them. Nuts, bolts, lock washers Woo. washers adhesive um, some undercoating black spray paint to make it look pretty flat bar plain steel floor tracks step three <laughs> now prep your materials okay here's what you do now that my floor tracks are cut i'm going to grind off any burrs that are sticking out are sharp edges. Now cut your flat bar steel into four pieces. That's how many pieces I need. Now that we have our four pieces of flat steel cut, we're gonna use our grinder and clean up the edges. If you run into the problem where you have to install a bracket right on top of your fuel tank, then this is how I did an easy fix. Drill a hole in your metal plate. Weld your nut onto your metal plate. There you have your brackets that are going underneath your van. Step number, boom, number four. This is when we are going to find where we are putting our holes. You have to find for yourself. I'm not gonna tell you where to put them because all this van stuff is straight up custom. But I'm gonna show you how I did it. Super easy. Let's go. I took my loose floor track, these puppies that we cut, and I attached my seat onto my floor track. Okay, then I slid my seats to exactly where I wanted the gap to be. Once you find your spot where you want your seats, you go and you mark in your holes, okay, where your bolts are gonna go. Mark one hole, mark your other hole. Of course, make sure it's all even and exactly where you want it. Step number five. Once that's complete, we need to go under the van and we need to find out where those holes are going to come through. Grab your measuring tape and find a reference on where your holes are going to be. This is really important for when we go under the van and we find out if we're going to hit anything and how much clearance we're going to have. Whee! You come under the van, you find your reference point, you measure out, you find exactly where your hole is going to be drilled for your hardware. All right guys, this is where it gets difficult. If you can see it, there, that right there, is my hardware okay and there's another one back over here but it is under the fuel tank you obviously have this tank in the way you have all this stuff the drive line all this stuff in the way but if you get the nut welded onto um, your steel plate then all you have to do is simply hold that up there and they start running the bolt right through it it picks up automatically and holds in place that one obviously was super easy. This one was super easy. Find your reference point inside. Make sure that you're not hitting the frame, the chassis, any lines, the fuel tank, all that good stuff. Six. Once you've crawled under the van and verified that you're not going to hit anything, then drill your holes. Drill the holes. Real good. I recommend using a small drill bit first then a larger drill bit, the actual size that you need. Now install your floor tracks. Lock washer. 
washer through your floor track the bolt will go through and these two will meet underneath that's what it looks like Troop, sandwiched do that for every single one now prep your metal plates i sprayed them with resist rust rubberized paintable crap and i also put some adhesive silicone on the bottom then this goes shoop, sucks right up to the bottom of your van prevents rust creates a good seal throw your brackets down throw all your hardware in have someone underneath the van with those steel plates with the nut welded on top have them hold it you just sit here with your gun here 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 now that you have your brackets in you go ahead and you attach your seats watch our van tour video also if you haven't check out some of the weird super weird challenges that my wife makes me do okay it's actually kind of fun if you like this content like and subscribe okay i'll catch it oh